Hello and welcome to the 15th annual Emerson Los Angeles Film Festival. I'm Madeline Avery. We're at the Emerson Los Angeles Center in the heart of Hollywood, where film screenings, panels, workshops, and an awesome reception are all in store for this evening. We're gonna show you the best parts of the festival. Follow me. There were informative panels on the explosion of online comedy shorts featuring BuzzFeed, Funny or Die, and UCB Comedy, as well as a panel on diversity in Hollywood sponsored by the Ebony Alumni Association. So to be able to come back as an alumni and help curate a program has been really, really great. It's like a 360 moment. Um, what we're really trying to do is just have a platform for these filmmakers so that they can talk about the creative process. One of the most moving discussions was the panel out on screen and behind the camera moderated by actor Wilson Cruz. Guests on the panel included transgender activist Jen Richards, who recently appeared on the E! special I Am Kate, and Our Lady J, a writer of the Amazon series Transparent that swept the Emmys this year. Periodicals, magazines, newspapers are not only being respectful about trans people, but we're starting to get a little bit of, of actual access behind the scenes. And that's, that's going to make a huge difference in the long run. A big part of the festival included looking at how technology can take filmmaking to new heights. Wild Rabbit Productions brought two drones to the festival for an amazing showcase of the hottest production gear today. Festival goers got to see how technology is changing in Hollywood with an exciting actual virtual reality demonstration. I definitely, as soon as it ended, I was like, I was going to get in line to do another one. It's, it's really cool. I could see, I could see a lot of things that I'd be interested in doing with that kind of interface. The film festival is fun for the whole family. Animators and writers from the hit Netflix series BoJack Horseman showed how an episode gets made. There was even a class in animation where kids drew their own cartoons. What do you want to be when you grow up? An artist and a chef. An artist and a chef? That's what I'm But the real draw of the festival is the films of Emerson students, faculty, and alumni. Professor Lauren Shaw showed her documentary, Angor's Children. What was it like to be able to bring the film to Emerson and to the Emerson LA Film Festival? I couldn't have made this film without Emerson. I've been at Emerson a long time, and uh, I think that um, it was just the support that I've had, that I've felt through the years. At the award ceremony, she presented the Marsha Robbins Wilf Women in Film Award to students Jackie Carrier and Sophia Caetano. Cooper Vacheron won Students Best of Film Honors, and the winner of the Alumni Best of Festival, Jonathan Aide, had this to say about winning the $2,000 prize. I went into debt for this movie, and so I'm gonna be paying down my debt. <laughs> like, <laughs> well, it's all it's not, full circle. So it's just like, it's like, oh yeah, all this money that I put into the project. I, I'm not as broke as I was. LA's biggest and best party of the year, I'm Madeline Avery.